Hello all, today I will show you in this video how to make a one stroke. You will see how to make a gradient with acrylic paint and understand the basics of a one stroke. Here it is, I hope you'll like this video and that you'll enjoy it and find it useful. So to make a one stroke you will need acrylic paint. I'm using acrylic paint from LM Cosmetic Shop. It's very liquid but it covers the entire surface pretty well, so it's convenient. To make a one stroke, we will need two different colors. We will need a soft square brush or a beveled brush that we will dip in water. Then we dry it with paper. I dip one side of the brush in one color and the next side in the other color. I make the gradient on my palette to merge the colors and to remove the excess paint. And I can now make the one stroke. Let me show you once more. It's important to do it first on your palette. Now let's see how you make a simple petal. With your brush I go upward, then I make a U-turn and I go down. As you can see I go up, make the U-turn and go down. It can be done with other colors. You can also make different styles rather than half of each color. For example, one third of a color and two thirds of the other. One third of blue and two thirds of red to have a different effect. The method is basically the same as I've shown you earlier. Now, I invert the colors. I make two thirds of blue. You can also make little waves with your brush. You need to apply several coats on the paint, it takes some time. We can also draw the petals one over the other, like this. You don't have to separate them every time. Let me show you how it looks on a nail. I proceed like I've shown you. Then, if you have a hole in the middle, fill it with pink paint. Don't paste your design at the side of your nail or else you won't see it from the front. Now let's see another effect. I won't have to go up and down several times this time. I only make some small bridges like a cloud. And there you go, you have a different style. And now the third style, the one I've shown you earlier. I make the petal one on the other. I try to paint the beginning and not the end since I will draw the petals over it. And that's it for the one stroke method. Here is the nail art I end up with on my nails. You can watch all the tutorials in the one stroke nail art kit on the LM Cosmetic website. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it's been useful to you. Did you like it? You want to see more? Subscribe!